Snowmobile Sessions Live. Enjoy the ride. So I'm here with Len, uh, and he's uh, he's the developer of the the, uh, the helmet light. Um, good to meet you, Glenn. How's the show been? It's been great, Gary. Thanks for uh, chatting with me. Appreciate no, it. No problem. Now, Glenn was just starting, or sorry, Len was just starting to uh, tell me a little bit about the history of the light. So what happened is uh, I started this about eight years ago. My brothers and I do an annual trip to the state of Maine. Some great riding up there. And we encounter a lot of snow dust, and every year somebody would have a mishap, like hit a guy in the back or whatever, and I decided to put a light on the back of my helmet as a way of making it safer for us. At first, the guys were kind of laughing at me, like, what are you gonna light on your helmet for? But by the end of the trip, they had me out front because the snow dust was so bad. The next weekend, we rode in Pittsburgh, New Hampshire, and I had made 10 more lights on my kitchen table for the rest of the gang, and we went out again, and once we had 11 lights in action, that's when the light bulb went off in my head. And my brothers and my friends were like, you gotta sell these things, these are incredible. It's how it all started, that's, eight years ago. That's excellent, what's your full name? It's Leonard Johnson, and I own LJE Products, and I'm also a part of Bite Hotter. Nice, nice. And uh, yeah, like, so how, I, I, I might have missed this, but how many years ago was it that you developed this? Eight years ago. Eight years ago, so this is pre. This is way before oxygen or BRP started to put them on their helmets. Um, you're pretty much the pioneer of lit, lit heads on this. So I, I wouldn't say I invented it. I just figured out as an electrician how to tap off the power coming to the electric shield to run a light as an accessory. Because with the battery light, you're limited by the lifespan of the battery, how bright it can be. But with 12 volts of power from the snowmobile, you can literally have as bright a light as you want. Yeah, that's nice. And they are super bright, I can't believe it. So thanks again for your time today, Len. I uh, really appreciate meeting you and uh, we'll hope to see you on the trail. Hey, thanks, Gary. Cheers. <laughs>